Hello and welcome. This is Regan Hillier here. I'm so grateful to be here with you right now on this amazing group immersion, activating your goddess within. <sighs> Go ahead and sit or lie in a comfortable position, allowing yourself to lean back and surrender as you gently close your eyes. As your eyes begin to fall shut, that's it. Allowing yourself to fall deeply into the intention through this powerful group immersion of utilizing the vortex of all of us here together right now in order to truly activate your goddess within. That's it. And as you allow yourself to drop deeper into this state, of transformation, of alchemy, of remembrance, you begin to notice that you are in the most divine location right now. As you draw your attention to the location around you, you notice that there are multiple Greek pillars around you. And you continue to notice as you expand your awareness that you are indeed, in fact, amongst sacred ruins on the island of Delos, centered in the middle of the Greek islands. That's it. You may visually see this space. You may feel it. You may just know that you were there, but either way is just perfect. Good. And as you ground even deeper into this beautiful vortex on Delos Island in the Greek islands. You begin to notice that you are not alone. In fact, you are surrounded by so many other women, so many other goddesses who have shown up at a soul level right here, right now, in order to complete this activation with you. That's it. And as you notice the divine beings that are in your presence, just as you are in theirs, you may feel inclined to go out and reach out your hands so that you are connecting with the person and the people next to you. That's it. Allowing yourself to gently embrace the hand of the divine being on your right and the divine being on your left. As every single person in this space begins to physically connect up, allowing their energetic fingers to connect, amplifying the energy in this vortex flowing through you, flowing through each and every single one of you right now. That's it. Feeling the waves of this vortex flowing through you, flowing through your body, flowing through the group, flowing through the space. You notice that you are surrounded in these ancient Greek ruins by 13 divine pillars. 13 divine pillars that are indeed, in fact, a part of the temple of men, the house of men. This place, this divine sacred temple was used as a gathering point for all men, for the divine masculine. Why are you here, you may ask? Quite simply, because as we activate your goddess within and the divine feminine begins to rise into the remembrance of who she truly is, you are to be witnessed, witnessed and held by the divine masculine in every second, in every breath, as the masculine holds you safely and securely as you continue to rise. And simply by witnessing this transformation, the sacred masculine will also indeed rise. And that's it. Beautiful. Calling in divine beings of light, light beings of the highest vibrations, any appropriate angels, guides, saints and sages to come down into the space right now. 
Ah, welcome, welcome, welcome. You may see specific beings, specific guides show up right here. You may feel them. You may feel the divine presence, or you may just know that they are there, but either way, it's just perfect. Beautiful, welcome. And from this space, we begin to run the energies through these 13 pillars that house us in the house of men right now. That's it. Allowing these pillars to form a connection point, shooting a red laser beam down through each and every single pillar and simultaneously through your own core right now, centering this red laser beam all the way down through your tail, connecting down all the way down into the crystalline center of the earth. That's it, and then allowing a golden beam of light to shoot up, up through your spine, through your crown, connecting you all the way to your soul star. As simultaneously, a golden beam of light shoots through the pillars, connecting these 13 pillars all the way to the cosmos, allowing this place to be fully girded right now, stabilized with these connection points. Ah, that's it. Letting all of this energy flow through these pillars and through the vortex as we ground into the true stable essence of who we are, as every single cell begins to wake up and remember who we are, as the goddess within each and every single one of us allows herself to become more and more present to us in this moment in time. Beautiful, connecting all of this energy through the grids of the earth right now, all the grids running through Delos Island, running through the Greek islands, running across the entire planet, allowing the entire planet to be humbly aware of this activation taking place right now. And connecting now these grids of planet Earth beyond through to the cosmos, allowing them to connect up. Beautiful, solidifying this connection. That's right, beautiful. And now requesting that any energy that is stuck or not of the highest, that is stuck within these grids and not allowing a clean and complete connection point, requesting that this shift and clear out of the field right now. No romoi, na kerame, na yase shore moe. Na yasa kramai, no kro, na yasi shi mai karamai. No roe sai shai mai kro, mai na kerame. Na ikramai, ayasa kro, shukro, na kerame, na karmoe. Oe mai na yase, na yakro, shu. Beautiful, allowing all of that to continue to clear through these grids as you become more and more and more aware of the grids between yourself, your own field, linking you to all the other divine beings present right here, right now in human form. And as these grids connecting all of us together continue to illuminate and light up, you become more and more aware that these grids connect deeply to the 13 pillars that connect you deeply to all of the grid lines on the planet and beyond. Beautiful. Tuning in right now to any distortion that has been blocking or stopping you fully activating your goddess within, fully standing in your truth, fully standing in your light. I decree and declare that this be the exact moment in time that all of this distortion begins to shift, shift, shift and clear out of your field right now. Going in and requesting that any imprints, any negative implants, any distortion that has been imposed upon your field that has disconnected you from your power, requesting this shift and clear and dissolve with ease and grace and flow out of your field right now. I decree and declare that any distortion that has disconnected you from your truth, from the true essence of who you are, from the truth and the power of your goddess, requesting that all of this shift, clear and dissolve with total ease and grace and flow. Beautiful. 
a decree and declare that any distortion imprinted on your field that has disconnected you from your true voice, the voice of your goddess, disconnected you from the goddess being able to speak through you. I request that all of those geometries and fallen light templates, I request all of that shift out of your field instantly with ease, grace and flow. No crush. Any patterns running within your field where you have been telling yourself that you are not enough, that you are not enough of a goddess, that you are not connected to your goddess, that that is something outside of you, that it is something that you are not, clear, 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 shift, dissolve. No kruese nai si kramai, nai kromoe se shkuromoe nai, nai kramai. Connecting now to any residual fear, fear of not being seen, fear of being seen, fear of being too bright or not bright enough. Any of these fears that have blocked you or stopped you or limited you, from truly connecting to your God goddess within, within, to fully standing in your power, in your truth, and absolutely area of your life. I decree and declare right now that all of that begins to shift and dissolve out of your field, completely clearing it out right now. No cross. Tuning in right now to any constructs which have been running in your field in the past, which have created an illusion of separation, an illusion that you are separate from your goddess, an illusion that you are separate from God. Anything running within this field is distortion. It is not true. It is not of your highest light. It is not from your soul. It is not connected to your higher self. We banish it. We banish it. We banish it. Now, nae koro mai ni kresh koro mo nae kra mai ni ese kra mai na kra ma e kra me kra me kra mai nae sh no ro mo nae ese kra me ai e koro mo na ka e se ma kra mo ni e koro mo nae sh na kra mo e sh. Beautiful. And continuing this clearing process, now shifting and clearing out any old distortion and any outdated DNA, any of these structures that have been lying dormant at a cellular level, any geometry still encoded at a cellular level within your DNA, any old or outdated DNA that simply gets to clear and shift and drop out of the field right now, dropping, 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 clearing out, shifting out any residuals right now, and so it is. Beautiful. Allowing that clearing process to continue to take place, clearing out any remaining or residual distortion or imprints that were left in the field and requesting that that process continues to purge out of your field. And now from this place of clarity, of openness, now that we have created the space within your field for the new geometries to come through, I now decree and declare that this will be the exact moment in time for you to fully activate your gifts, to fully step online, for you to fully tune into the truth of who you are and activate all of your gifts that are your natural state that have been lying dormant, maybe coming in at some sort of capacity, but you know, you know, you know, as you remember that deep down in your cells, there is more to come online. There is more of your innate gifts that you are born with, that you are utilizing in the planet, that are a divine part of your mission and your purpose so that you may be of greater service to the planet right now. I decree and declare a full and complete activation of your gifts now. <laughs>
nai karamai nai sakorame kai ai si shi karamai nai kromoi nuromo karamai nai karamai nai sakrame si shur he da mai karomoi nai karamai nai sakrame karmi nai sai shur moi na kai sai sakramai na kroi nuromoi nai sai shi kai romoi nai shu beautiful requesting right now a full and complete activation of your voice your capacity to use your voice your capacity to allow your goddess to speak through you your capacity to be directly connected to source and allow the expression of the goddess to be seen and to be heard your unique capacity to stand in your truth and speak your truth each and every single day tuning in into the throat right now and requesting that the throat open and expand clearing out any distortion or blockedness or stuckness in there allowing all of this to open and expand i decree and declare that your voice activate now Beautiful. Requesting the full and complete activation of your courage and your conviction to stand in your power. A full and complete activation of your courage and your conviction to stand in your goddess. A full and complete activation of your courage and your conviction to stand in your truth. The truth of who you are, the truth of your light, the truth of your mission, the truth of your purpose, the truth of why you are here, why you chose here, right here, right now. I do decree and declare that your courage and your conviction of your innate divine power activate and turn on to its full capacity now no rei mai si shu rokrame ai kara makrame na kara me ai na ye kai shu na kara me shu so rekne na se krana ta kare me na kara me no rokre me si shi ke ama kai na yo kro mo ai na mai si kara mai na yo mo kro ai mi kro na kara me hisai Beautiful. Turning right now to your soul and the light that you embody from within and requesting that divine radiance and beauty come into your field, allowing you to fully embody this through the divine feminine. Remembering that beauty is from the inside, radiance is from the inside. Beauty and radiance is not just an inside job; it's a soul job. And as you connect with that, and you remember, you begin to wake up and remember. You wake up and remember how beautiful you truly are, how radiant you truly are. You begin to remember how beauty and radiance is your natural state. And from this moment forward, every single cell begins to radiate with the divine beauty and the truth of who you are, the goddess. Shines through. Na kroi me sai sai si kroi mai kai. Noro mo sai na yoro na kro mai sai na ko na ko mo re sai na ko na ko ro mo sai na ko na ko ro mo sai. Beautiful. And from this deep divine remembrance of the divine beauty and the divine radiance that you embody at a cellular level, your full ability to nurture begins to wake up and come online. You begin to remember your capacity to nurture yourself, to nurture the goddess within you, to nurture others, to nurture your wealth. to nurture your body to nurture your relationships to nurture your family 
to nurture the beings that you care about in this planet, to nurture the whole of humanity, you begin to remember that being this being of nurturing is indeed your natural state. Your cells know what to do. Your body knows what to do. Your soul definitely knows what to do. Connect in now with what is different. Now this element of nurture has come back online. And as every single cell begins to expand into this divine state of nurture, you begin to remember that part of activating the goddess within you is truly remembering your capacity to connect with the Divine Mother. The Divine Mother, she who nurtures all, she who is pure love, she who is pure light of the highest vibration. And you begin to remember that there is no separation between the Divine Mother and your soul. We are one, we are connected. And from this place, we re-establish this divine connection. As your new DNA begins to come online, and this DNA that maybe is coming down right now into your field, into your body, or maybe it's been sitting there dormant, ready for a command to simply wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up. As you choose to remember who you are, you choose to remember that you are the goddess and you choose to activate the goddess within right now, requesting that all of your DNA come online now. And from this space and this place, every single cell of your being begins to embody at a cellular level your sacred feminine allowing all these elements to wake up and remember and come online and truly be embodied so that when you walk, when you talk, when you move, when you choose, with every single breath, you allow yourself to go even deeper and deeper and deeper into the truth of your sacred feminine. Shoo, nai say shoo, nai say shoo. Nice issue. Nice issue. Beautiful. And from this space and this place, as you feel the openness, the activation, and the expansion within your field, go ahead and turn your awareness right now to all the other fields around you, connected to the divine beings of light who are present with you in this activation. And notice the collective opening and expansion which has now taken place in your field and, of course, the field of the group. Beautiful. Encased and held deeply by these 13 pillars of the Divine Masculine, we now open and create space 
for the 13 intuitive goddess codes to come down into the space, inviting the 13 sacred intuitive goddess codes to come down into the space. You may see the codes beginning to come down, drop down, come down even deeper. You may feel them. You may just know that they are there. Either way is just perfect as they begin to drop down gently into the field. The new glistening, beautiful, divine, golden, crystalline geometries begin to come down. 13 intuitive codes anchoring into your field right now, anchoring into the field of the collective. Beautiful. And we decree and declare right now that as these anchor into the field, we allow them to begin to grow roots, stabilizing, solidifying within your field and the field of the Divine Collective right now. Beautiful. You may witness these 13 intuitive goddess cards as 13 balls of golden light now spinning and vibrating right in front of you allowing them to settle in these divine new geometries so sacred so perfect anchoring into the field that's it you may feel the energies of these 13 cards now running through your body and running through your field you may feel the electric sense of remembering that you already know what these are you have felt them before and now is a great day for the great return of all of these codes to come down and drop down and lock down into your field. That's it. As you feel this wave of golden white light flowing through yourself, through your own field, and through all the divine fields around you, all the divine fields of the beings, that's it. As all of it begins to flow through, you focus your intention right now, individually and collectively, with each and every single soul present in this activation. And you connect right now from your inner goddess and you allow your goddess to radiate from the inside out. That's it. And as every single female in this group right now connects with their intuitive goddess and allows their goddess to radiate from the inside out, you notice the feeling and the sensation of the entire sacred temple right now being lit up, absolutely lit up with golden white light as every single goddess right now allows her intuitive inner goddess to shine through, radiating this place on the planet. That's it. And now we allow this divine radiation of light of the highest frequency of light of the highest vibration. We allow this to connect all the women in the circle right now. You may feel the energy of the collective of the vortex pulsating through you as it begins to spin and naturally upgrade your unique signature, your unique frequency, your vibrational signature begins to upgrade with the spinning golden white light flowing through you and flowing through this vortex. Beautiful. And now we take this collective energy and we allow it to flow through the space, flowing through the vortex, connecting in to the 13 pillars, which are, remember, connected to the grid lines on the planet. And from this place, through the field of our hearts, we go ahead and we send this golden white light energy of the rising feminine, of the activated intuitive goddess. We send this through the grid lines. Whew, that's it allowing it to vibrate through your own field, through the field of the group, through the field of the pillars, through the field of grace, through the field of the entire planet. As this golden white light ascension energy comes through activating and waking up every single woman on the planet right now, every single intuitive goddess that is truly ready to step into her power, to step into her truth, to step into her voice, to remember who she is as collectively we remember who we are. Your goddess within simply says to you, I remember who I am. I remember who I am. I remember who I am. And that vibration of that affirmation of the remembrance cycles through the entire vortex of the group, all of the fields present, cycling through all the way through the grid lines, vibrating out through the entire planet, vibrating out through the energetic grid lines, connecting this planet to all the other planets in the cosmos right now. That's it, allowing all beings of light to embody their divine feminine right now. 
simultaneously allowing all of the men to also be activated and activate their inner feminine as they witness and hold the rising of the feminine right here, right now in this present moment in time. That's it, all beings through the entire planet allow lit up and illuminated with this vibration, this vibration of remembrance, this vibration of truth, this vibration of pure light, this vibration of the activation of your goddess within. upgrades through the field of your heart, allowing the energy within your field, the energy within the field of this group vortex, the energy through the 13 pillars, the energy through planet Earth, and the energy through all the planets, through all the beings beyond planet Earth right now. Requesting all of that to be filtered through everyone's heart center. Requesting that all of these upgrades, shifts, transformations, and elements of remembrance continue 24 hours a day, seven days a week, until they are fully stabilized, anchored, and complete. <sighs> Take your time to sink into gratitude for what you allowed to just happen in your own field, in the field and the vortex of this group immersion, this group activation. <sighs> for what you allowed to just happen for the field of humanity and beyond. Thank you, Goddess. Thank you for saying yes. Thank you for showing up. Thank you for being so present, so open, so available. These shifts and these upgrades will continue. So allow yourself to be open to anything or anyone, any situation or any being which is looking to clear and purge out of your field because it is no longer a vibrational match to your new activated vibration. The purge can be easy. It can happen with ease and grace. You do not have to struggle through it. Although it is a necessary part of the process. And simultaneously, be open, conscious and aware for all the magic and all the miracles that now get to take place. When you are looking for miracles and when you expect miracles as an activated goddess, then that, beloved, is what you shall see. Then that, beloved, is what you shall receive. Beautiful. 
thanking the beings of light, the angels, the guides. So much gratitude. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for assisting in this process. Thank you to each and every single one of you for being so present and so available. Closing down the fields right now, grounding them down. All work complete as you allow yourself to come back gently into the space that you're in, in the physical form, gently into your body, being conscious and aware of your breath. What does your breath feel like as a truly activated goddess? That's right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you feel called to go deeper on this journey with me, and if you want to individually activate every single one of the 13 intuitive goddess codes, then I invite you to come and go deeper into a powerful online immersion with me. You can see all of the information and everything you need to know at sylvana.com forward slash goddess. It would be an honor to hold you in the space and to go deeper with you if you are truly ready to take the next step in this journey. And if not, I celebrate you and I applaud you for being here and for showing up and for doing the work. I see you. I love you. I honor you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. My name is Regan Hillier, and I can't wait to see you on the next group immersion.